Hey guys, back with a quick update video on the Focus, and look at that S3 over there. Anyways, just an update video, it's going to be a winter update, or beginning. Uh, as you can see, we did put the winter tires on the other day. Yeah, uh, can you not? But um, anyways, we plasti dipped them, they look a lot better. My dad wanted to try that out, and it looks pretty good. And the plasti dip down here is holding up really good, and up here it's doing really well. No peeling or anything. Exhaust tip is just kind of, I've lost, you know, interest in that, keeping it decent, because we just painted it black, so, you know, it's just there. Looks better than nothing. It looks really aggressive, the way the tires and everything and the rear blacked out stuff looks. But, um, everything's doing, guys, have it at the car wash right now, I took to the touchless one. And, um, yeah, outside, everything's doing good on the outside, nothing too much to report there. Just more bug chips and everything. And here's the uh, winter tread, I mean, I just drove in fresh snow right here, but really aggressive it works you know it's the first time i've driven it this year and it you know, grips pretty good so my dad does want to get a focus st in the springtime he's been talking about that so i'm excited really excited for that so anyways probably not gonna have this next year but um yeah no problem with that and coming in i don't the lights are on and the seat for 72,000 miles it's doing all right I mean it's nothing too too bad it's just you know getting shiny and stuff not too many crease marks just like an ass crit mark right here lifting up but it, oh well it's a highway car I guess everything else is nice weather tech floor mats are doing really good I mean as you can see it's pretty dirty the car on the inside I just got in and figured I'd make a video real fast as I have it for a little bit today but just starting it on up I just got gas and everything so um, tire pressure because he doesn't have those in his tires. He didn't want to spend the 150 bucks it would cost, which I don't blame him. So it's no big deal. And we just did the oil, and it's gonna say the oil too. Just it bitches about that stuff because we didn't reset it. And he has like 10,000 or 15,000 mile oil in it, so he can go until like 85,000. So there you go. Everything else, you know, the wheel's wearing, it's shiny, it's not to the point where it's like wearing off, but it's just the leather is shiny, so, oh well. Everything else is doing good, you know, except the only thing I don't like about this car is the fucking, I, I say fucking as in fucking, 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 hate this, hate this transmission, it sucks ass. How, it's just, it's bad. And the, my Ford Touch is laggy as shit too, because my dad hasn't, uh, have it, or hasn't had it updated, so, it sucks. And this hasn't been updated, and it sucks. And I don't like how small these buttons are as I've been using it. And the car just feels like it's not refined enough, but, I mean, that's what happens when you rush things forward. I mean, this feels like a rushed car to me. As far as the exterior and all that, it, I mean, it's nice, but it's just, you know, not very ergonomically friendly for me. I mean, my dad loves the thing. I mean, he's got all these gadgets and stuff, so happy for him, I guess. Sunroof, you know, center console, and... These little things we got offline, these little focus inlay mats, um, actually, somebody on YouTube, it was, um, I forgot his YouTube channel, it was MKM230, he had these in his focus, and that's how I found out about these, so, cool little thing there, um, that's about it for up here, headliner is clean, because nobody ever touches it, um, pop the trunk, real fast, Back seat. Nobody ever sits back here. It's just a highway car, basically. My dog is the only one that rides back here, so it's pretty dirty. So yeah, when we go to sell, he's gonna have to get it detailed because I'm not gonna detail that interior. Too much dusting. Pretty decent room. He must have cleaned it. He has his road kit back there in case because he drives um, pretty far. And he goes through Detroit, Michigan every day, and you know, just be prepared if you get stuck down there because that's that's an animal zoo. That's Monkey's Town. Um, let's see. Yeah, that's about it. He's going to get new front brakes in the winter and new rear brakes. I think front ones only. I don't know about the rear. He's going to get slotted because they do need to be replaced after that many miles of highway driving and such. Plastic dip on the grill. Nothing's peeled off yet, surprisingly. And the markers aren't peeling or anything. Those Goodyear wiper blades from Costco, I don't like them. They, they're, they're not too good, but that's just me. Where's the latch at? It's right over here. It's always over here. Um, there you go. Air intake, we just blew that out as we just uh, changed the oil and everything. Regular maintenance wheels like last week, so. That's about it, guys. I just wanted to make a quick little video on this. 
And I want to get out of here before that guy comes because it's going to take forever pulling out of this place. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. We'll talk to you later.